Your Natchez History Minute is brought to you by Natchez National Historical Park. On February 17, 1819, the State Assembly granted a charter for the establishment of the Elizabeth Female Academy, located in Washington, Mississippi. Named for Elizabeth Roach Greenfield, who donated the land upon which the school was located, the Academy was the first female educational institution in the state. The Methodists operated the Academy and naturally emphasized a spiritual culture rather than training women for a profession. The curriculum included chemistry, biology, natural and moral philosophy, botany, Latin, and other subjects. The great naturalist painter John James Audubon taught drawings at the Academy in May and June of 1822. In 1845, the school closed, due in part to the relocation of the state capital from nearby Natchez to Jackson, as well as the occurrence of several epidemics of yellow fever in the area. Sadly, the site was reduced to ruins by a fire in the late 1870s. Part of a brick wall is all that now remains of the Elizabeth Female Academy buildings. I'm Sarah Carter-Smith, Alderman for the City of Natchez, and this has been your Natchez History Minute.